All right, so fake eyelashes comments that was stated by Miss Green towards Miss Crockett, and then Miss Cortez put her two cents in. I want to definitely go back and look at the full entire video from start to finish that led up to that point because from what we heard in there with the comments, there was definitely something that we should not ever see in the political arena, especially when they're in the middle of handling business because they are representing thousands of people in the U.S. from whatever district that they are from. Now, why have we resorted to this kind of behavior in politics, you all? As we know, race, religion, and politics are very, very touchy subjects um, online and in person or whatever, but who would have ever thought today that we would see something like this? Now, this is not the first time that this has happened in a political arena. This, these kinds of comments has happened before amongst other representatives and senators. Um, it just may not have been recorded and published online, but the fact that this one made it online just goes to show you that this is why, this is one of many reasons why a lot of young people don't pay attention or care to even, even be concerned about politics in general because they, they can't even trust the people that are representing them now, look at what was said, look at the rebuttal, look at how, you know, she said her thing back, and it shouldn't have never resorted to degrading someone's physical look in this type of environment anyway. Now, they're at a theme park somewhere, that's a whole nother ballpark, but what makes it so interesting is the fact that this happened within the um, building. Uh, itself while they were meeting trying to handle and take care of business and the the word of advice to all the young people out there that are seeing this is you know hopefully this is something that will never happen again and that we can definitely change this in, 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 in regards to being more professional when we are put in roles like this that's almost similar to a CEO of a company saying something bad to one of their employees while they're on a work site. Definitely uncalled for, unnecessary, should not even ever have gotten to that point. But this is the age that we live in. So now, this is something that's never gonna be forgotten. And nobody got hurt, physically hurt over this, but just the fact of how people are really thinking about their opinions, about how other people look, verbally came out, and this is not the way that we handle business, you all. So, the next step is, what happens after this? What will happen to Ms. Green? What will happen to Ms. Crockett? What will happen to Ms. Cortez? What will go on? What's the next step to resolve the situation after this? Definitely share your thoughts in the comments uh, below, below, people. I want to truly know what your thoughts are or what you think will happen uh, down the line and uh, or if anything will happen at all. But definitely very unprofessional. And this is something that the world, the U.S. and even the world should not see. Politicians degrading each other, talking about each other and all that, this, that, and the third. So like, listen, subscribe, people, oilolive.com. You can go and search for the video online. I'm sure a lot of people have posted it out there. Look forward to bringing more content to you soon.